Came and make a hot tub. We beat the party, stop tub. Bubbling up just like lava, like lava. Heated like a sauna. Penetrating through your body, ah, ma. Rhythmically with my shot, ya. With hip hop mixed up with samba, with samba. So, yes, yes, y'all. You know we never stop, we never rest, y'all. The black eyed peas are keeping it funky fresh, y'all. And we won't stop until we get y'all. Till we get y'all, say it. whether you're sexy or not, you are oh. a goddess. Yes. No. You move your body so well. Everything is well placed, you're graceful, but you still have that sexiness. The only thing for me is please just let go. Don't be afraid. No. Do not be afraid, because you've got it in there, but you're still questioning yourself, and you could be amazing. <laughs> that was brilliant. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> and there's the voice of experience. We you know. Right, Bruno, Holly, you are a stunner with a capital S. I tell you, you, the thing is, you have all the top of the range equipment. <laughs> but you really have, but you still have a few gremlins in there that you need to tune out. Yeah. It's like a Formula car. You know, when you first put it on the road, you need a few laps to get her going, but well, you've got plenty of mileage in front of you. Tune it up, baby, because you've got it. Yeah. <laughs> Words of wisdom there. How about you, Craig? Uh, some timing oh. issues there oh. on all the ones who got horribly out of time on stage. Oh. The limbo straddle that you did, you could have gone a lot further with that idea. Uh, great hip rotation, though. I thought um, fantastic that you're starting to put those half uh, head whips in, which yes. is good. I thought the whole routine was really, really great. Yeah, I love it. <laughs> hey. Um, Ned, yeah, how about you? My overriding criticism is that you... You, you wanted to go faster. You know, it's like pulling off a plaster. You want to get it over with, and you kept losing, <laughs> you kept losing the timing, and you were just ahead of the music. The other thing that concerned me, you flew through Artem's legs once, then he flew through yours twice. He was like a mechanic checking for an oil leak. Here he was going back through the thing. <laughs> that was, you know, apart from that, I thought it was great. So, well done. <laughs> oh, Liv. We're good to hear. Think of that next time. Look for an oil leak. OK, <laughs> off you go. That was fun. <laughs> yes! Wow. So also suits you, Holly. Frankly, it all suits that you went for it. It was more fun this week, definitely. It looked like a lot of fun. I mean, you are a laid-back Australian. <laughs> Autumn's a steely <laughs> Russian. That was an incredible routine. I mean, how, how is this working out so well? They're two very different personalities. I do as I'm told, and then it works. Good girl. I see. <laughs> right. She's got the right attitude. Yes. Been bitten by the ballroom bug yet, Holly? Uh, yeah, I think so, definitely. Yeah? Yeah. You're enjoying it. Yeah, very That's much. Good. Well, we're enjoying watching you dance. The scores are in. Ladies and gentlemen, the judges' scores are in. Craig Revelhall. Seven. <laughs> Seven. <laughs> Eight. <laughs> <laughs> That's a strong score. Yeah. Really well done.
well done. Call 09015 2220 if you don't want Holly to be given the kiss kiss off the competition. Oh, Put a lid on it, Anton. <laughs> All right, don't I underestimate yeah. how much these stars need your votes. Roger. They won't be here next week without you. But hold fire because the phone lines aren't open just yet. And don't forget, at bbc.co.uk forward slash Strictly, you can log on for all the latest backstage ballrooms. Brilliant.